Ready to go to work? You ready to find it, huh? You ready to find it, huh? You ready? Find it. When he gets as close to the source as he can, he, he'll scratch on Here. that location. All it takes is one sniff from outside. Check. Check. Good boy. Here. Good boy. All right. And this highly trained dog gives police reason to search inside. Nothing inside that car, huh? You seem really nervous. You don't use drugs? Well, oh, your answer was a little unusual. Not that I know of. That's not usually the answer I get. After a full search, police didn't find any drugs, but the driver admits someone might have smoked marijuana recently inside his car. It's that faint scent that set Jay the police dog off. Without him, our narcotics arrests would be significantly lower. With a sense of smell one million times greater than humans, Jay makes the perfect compliment to Officer Dave McConnell. It's, it's, it's a very specialized job, and without him, I don't have a job. The four dog team is responsible for majority of the roadside drug busts in Cape Coral. And a lot of the times when we make an arrest based on the dog, if we didn't have the dog, there wouldn't have been an arrest. For the first time ever, NBC2 hit the streets with the Cape Coral Canine Unit. The reason I stopped you, one of your headlights aren't working. I can't read your tag. I just don't understand why you're going so fast. You seem really nervous. To us, it was an action-packed night. A hooch? A little hooch? To officers McConnell and Jay, it's just Friday. Don't play games with me. The beer that's behind there stuffed under the seat, is that yours or his? Stop after stop. Yeah, what's your name? For five hours, Jay kept sniffing. Shortly after midnight, he found something. Okay, Jay. You ready? We rolled up to Trafalgar Parkway, responding to an officer's request for the canine unit. Check here. Check. Gotcha. Yeah. Again, Jay's signal tips off police and leads to a thorough search of the car. What was your uh, pill? This time, police find something. Some rolling papers they use for marijuana, and inside the rolling papers is three blue pills. So the pills are either going to be two things, either hydrocodone, and, uh, or Xanax. Both admit to smoking marijuana in the car, but neither would admit to who owned the pills. If it belongs to one or the other, it'd be nice if you manned up and took it. Both are arrested, charged with possession of a controlled substance. With the emission of just smoking and rolling papers inside there, I'm pretty sure that there was, uh, there was odor of marijuana inside there. More than likely, that's what the dog hit, not necessarily the tablets that were inside of the the uh, rolling paper. Another team effort led by the nose of this policeman's best friend. Good boy.